to New York, Leonard Trusty. So that is the way to the Warrior
Uh, I don't know. I mean, I was just the 16 was. He's so good here. I, you know, every week you gotta. You know, he's a threat to win. And I just, you know, I thank Nick and them. You know, they run me so clean every single time we race each other. And uh, it was just cool to see us. You know, me and him, best friends on and off the track. So uh, I don't know. The, this thing loves the high line for some reason. It's not bad on the bottom, it's just, it loves the high line, so that's, yeah, I don't know, I just feed the high line and it just goes, I guess. Yeah, I was just trying to try different things to see what the thing would do at the end. Once Tom, uh, stepfather, said, you know, you're out for a little bit, I was like, all right, well, I gotta, might as well try something else to see what the car does and get a feeling for next week. So, uh, yeah, I just wanted to try a different line to see what would happen. Well, who else does somebody in the family got the 47 in First, my mom and my stepdad, Tom, Fallows Auto Wrecking, Anthony Flannery, Chassis Pro, uh, Todd, Hams Welding, SAAS, Lawn Care Property Maintenance, KH Dumpster Division, uh, Gearbox Specialties, Magnus Performance Products, my insane aunt up there, um, uh, Big Hoss Racing Products, Waddell Communications. Uh, there's just so many other people. Uh, my grandparents, Steve, Aaron, and everybody that helps back there. All that, without, all that, without their help coming here every week, you know, we just it would be too much. So uh, a lot of hard work goes into this thing week in and week out. So uh, quick show us tonight. Zach Sergamano has second win in the last two rounds. And then he's been out of the for quite a while. He's trying to work outside. It just looked like a 16 mile out of We're a little tight. We've been tight the last few weeks. It's something we'll figure out. But, uh, he ran me clean, he passed me on the bottom, he didn't move me, he didn't, I don't even think we touched once. He, he ran me as clean as I could be past the run. I think he's given up a little too much room, but uh, we've been friends since we were, since I was born. And, uh, at least if I made passes by him, but you know, I'd like to not finish second one of these times. <laughs> Uh, I gotta thank Critical Signs, uh, Chris Automotive, DNL Services, RG Seal Coating, Heidi's Creations, Iron Horse Equipment, Bisbee's Learning Center, my mom and dad and my grandma and grandma. Nick Huffy was second place. Now we're going to the final eight. We're going to the best team. See if we have time for a time. Yeah, that was good. Um, we just ran out of time. I, I feel like we could have got Nick in the last couple laps, but I had pressure from whoever was behind me. So um, good job to Zach. He, you know, for a guy that never driven anything before and coming here and have two wins so far this year. I mean, that's pretty incredible. So we're at the top box and our whole crew and uh, it's been uh, it's been fun driving with these guys. I just want to thank Bert and uh, Corey and uh, everyone that uh, helps us out. So a uh, good season so far. Tom Avery, the points leader, picks up a third place finish in our SK Light feature event.